And right now I'm trying to fix a problem um, I created myself. That's the matte varnish over the canopy. You can see how dull that looks. If I flip this around, you can suddenly see how shiny it is. And the windscreen is halfway done. And what I'm doing is I'm using a cotton wool, um, a pair of cotton wool Q-tips. Uh, cotton buds and I'm dipping them directly into Revel Colour Mix Thinner. I apply it, let it sit a moment and then I polish it back off with a dry end. So I'll be doing that on the front windscreens and these two side pieces and maybe these quarter lights at the rear. Um, I can't do the top rear because as you can see there are uh, decals on it. The decal marathon has tired me out and subsided a moment um i did if i point this out just here on the rear it's there under there have uh, a decal on a decal which is uh one of these number 68s that you can see on that fuel cap but there are so many more detailed items there's a pair of reds let's see if i find my uh cocktail stick so we've got a pair of reds there reds there we've got some more dots there we've got the fuel caps um, there's various lettering and writing if I actually turn it over there's several there you can see two a red and a black if it'll ever, if it'll ever focus there you go red and a black so we're getting there the sheet itself is running out um, 85 is a curious one. Let's just show you 85. So, it's a it's a T shape with a, a line, and it's not clear here quite what it does. I think it's meant to wrap around the boom. So it's meant to go. It's meant to go from the outside of a boom around its underside. So there's absolutely no way I'm getting that decal on in that position doing that 87 is also a difficult one because um well it's, it's just a piece of text and i don't know if it's going to stick just like the uh which of what i've got upside down if i show you the the one i mean sticking that decal on that cover on the orange decal was an absolute pain in the arse no other way around it it was just an absolute beast of a thing to get on there other things i have done is i have touched up the silver here it needs another coat yet in fact you can see you can see just there it needs a bit of another coat but uh, while we're watching actually yeah uh, i think those two are dead so let's get a fresh cotton bud and we dip it directly in the thinner and then what we do is touch it on and just let it sit the same for the windscreen And then where it's sat, I'm going to spin you can see it's coming off. So there we go, that's what I'm doing basically, getting the, uh, the matte varnish off. I'll continue.